Hello everybody, time for a new shave. Yep, got a haircut. Real nice, it was so damn long. <laughs> no, it wasn't so long, but I don't want to have long hair. <coughs> uh, today I'm gonna use a new soap. Uh, soap is from uh, Moran the Barbarian. Uh, John from, John from, I don't know where he's from, no, I'm kidding. This is a CK6 formula, as you can see there, and never used it, I just smelled it really nice. It had been hot or something, so it had been sliding the soap. I think it will work. And I think that it's really nice. And I'm gonna finish with Benjamin Barber Black Oak, Black Oak, yes, Black Oak, uh, Auto Shea Balm. This nice uh, brush from Marion, 24mm fan tip. 24mm fan tip. And the razor of today, I'm gonna to put that there, is this one. It's the razor from John June. He sent me a while ago. I have tried it once and uh, I cut myself on that corner. I have muted that corner now, so I hope it will work better. <laughs> it's a modified gold dollar blade. Um, the idea was for me to use that razor several times but if you have followed my channel you know I have uh, been busy holding my own razors and trying the edges and so on so I haven't had the time to use his uh, his uh, razor it's really nice gold roller razor uh, modified of course shorten up and put a nice sharp point on it so you can <laughs> cut yourself with and uh, put the new scales on it so uh, yeah nice work JJ I'm gonna put uh, the description in, uh, oh, in the description I'm gonna put um, oh, under the description oh no in the descriptions it's the description box sorry I'm holding it again as usual <laughs> Gonna put the links of all the persons I'm gonna mention in this video. So now we shall see. I think I overloaded it. Really pasted at the moment, as you can see. Really pasted and cakey. Oh, thick as hell. But a little water. <clears throat> now we shall see if we can. <coughs> manage to get it a little softer and then start to build a ladder here. I like this scent very much. It's leathery woody scent in my opinion. I don't never ever oh very seldom look at the descriptions of soaps or the scent descriptions and so on because it's the same thing about wine or cigar. Now this wine has taste vanilla and oak and some fruitiness and so on. And I taste the wine. I can feel it's a great wine. Tastes really nice, but I never ever could feel the vanilla. <laughs> Maybe the oak sometimes, but. It's my nose and my taste. I have a not so sophisticated taste. Also, the only thing I know, it tastes good, smells good. That's good enough for me. Of course, you can train these things a lot by practicing, but I don't feel that I have the time. <laughs> Too lazy. The same, th same thing is with cigars. Of course, I can feel it. it's a really heavy cigar, or if it's a light cigar, but I can't feel all the all the scents and all the taste that there is in these cigars. But I don't care so much. If I like it, I like it. Same thing is about soaps, brushes, razors, and so on. 
If I like it, I like it. If not, then I. Sorry. Then I tell you that I don't like it. Simple as that. It doesn't have to be so complicated. It doesn't mean if I don't like it, somebody else like it very much. It's a personal thing, this taste and scent thing. So this small five gold dollar with uh, I don't remember the, what the information on the scales was, or what doesn't matter. It's the age that's the most important. No, I'm kid not kidding. Of course the scales are important. They're really beautiful. Really, really beautiful in my opinion. <laughs> I couldn't see Just hanging that ladder on a blade and it dropped. I had one day of growth. And I actually, do you see that? <laughs> actually cut. <laughs> Just felt it grabbed something and two seconds later it was blood. That was my fault. Nothing to do with the blade. <laughs> I remember this. Doesn't happen so often to me. Sometimes I mix, of course, but not like this. I didn't felt it, but I just felt it was grabbing and I chopped that off. Whatever it was. Yeah, that was the first pass. I wonder if I'm going to take. I got this all on block. If I need it, I'm going to use it. Go and do a quick rinse. I do it because I want cold water on that one. See if you see. And I don't think so. So let's try to fix a problem like this. I wonder what it was, if there was something on the skin, I don't know. Something. I think I cut up something at least. <laughs> okay, see if that works. If not, we shall see. This soap, a really nice scent, really nice soap indeed. Really easy to layer up. It's great to skin and so on, everything is just wonderful. And I want to thank some people that have done things for me. Really, really awesome in my opinion. <coughs> As you know, I have some soaps sold all, all over the world to people. Uh, and Ken from Hawaii, Shave 326, he decided, I don't remember which day it was, but this weekend, that next time we're going to shave on Monday, he's going to do a Matty Monday. <laughs> and I thought that was really fun to hear. And I didn't expect that more than the Barbarian. Did a Marty Monday <laughs> using my stuff, uh, felt awesome, and then uh, 
you want your node to save uh, shade 3 to 60 the same and and who else so one more you want a note I appreciate you, and I do appreciate these gestures very much. Really fun to see the people like my soap and uh, doing this thing. I thank you. Then I saw a photo in uh, in uh, some irritation tattoo. What the fuck? Sorry, <laughs> tattoo. No, that's something else. Uh, I saw a photo on Instagram too, where I do apologize, I don't remember who it was. It's a guy from Montana. Did you, they took a really, really nice photo of the mountains and so on. And he did a Martin Monday shit too. And, uh, Really, really beautiful photo. So, thank you everybody that's doing this not the only shades. <laughs> I do appreciate it very much. Uh, nothing that I have expected to do. I just think it's awesome. I do. I don't know what to say. It's mind blowing in my opinion. <laughs> just gonna add a little bit more oil on that. Almost sealed up. A little bit more water like that. I should have had an orange stick, uh, some booboo juice, and golden recess, but I don't have any. And yes, a chunk of orange is away from this because I dropped it last time, oh, a couple of shades ago, on the floor and just broke. I don't like it, but <laughs> that's life. Yeah, so thank you everybody that's doing this Matty Monday shaves. I uh, don't want, no, I actually don't know what to say. It's awesome. I do appreciate it very much. It's more in the Bavarian that's selling my soap in USA. Uh, doing a great job. And uh, all you. YouTubers, all your people that buy my soap, not only YouTubers, there are a lot of other people seeing these shave of day pictures with my soap, it just feels great in my heart. I do appreciate it very much. Only thing I can say is thank you, thank you, and thank you again. used to D yesterday. I don't use D so often and I don't know why. Every time I use D I get irritation in my neck. Every time. I think I have wrong technique. I think I have to practice that. So maybe in the near future you're gonna see me using D erasers more often. I'm 100% sure it's the technique because I think I use too much pressure. I think yeah, it's just it's no problem, just cap. But uh, it's too much pressure, I think. As you can see, it seems to be sealed, no problem. I don't have the speed anymore to do shapes under 15 minutes because it's already 15.42, uh, 14.42, sorry. I have to do something to get these shapes under 15 minutes.
That's why I should I apologize. It takes more than 50 minutes. It only takes more than 50 minutes. If you don't want to watch it, well, yeah, then it's your problem, not mine. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I always try to do these shakes under 50 minutes because sometimes I have a tendency, sorry, not sometimes, every time I do shakes, I have a tendency to talk too much and I mumble too much and say stupid things and say wrong things and so on. So if I speed up these shakes a little bit more, I'm just going to rinse. Really nice. Oh, really nice feeling. Yeah. If I speed these shapes up a little bit, I don't talk so much, then, then maybe I wouldn't mumble so much and I would be more quality than mumble. <laughs> that just does me. I always mumbling, always talking shit and everything, and never keep the subject alive. I'm always talk about two, three, four things at the same time. So all over the place. Just a little bit more of this. Let's give you stuff. So now we're up to 16.45. And I think 17 minutes is the perfect time this time. So 10 seconds left. I can tell you, CDB is the king. Clown, the king of clowns, clown fruit. Sorry, king of clown fruit. Oh, more than 15 minutes, 70 minutes. I just want to mumbling again. Bye bye, everybody, and have a great, great uh, week. And uh, say hello to the king, CDB, king of clown fruit. Bye bye, so everybody. Bye. Just bow to the king. CDB, the king of clownfish. Clownfish, clown. Yeah, the king, at least. That's the one I'm gonna seal up soon. Bye bye.